Righto, uh, for the main game of the SAS Fox today down here, head coach for the Point Chivalier Pirates, there is no 80 minutes after this, mate. Nah. What's the plan? No, nah, there's not. Oh, well, you know, you know, last week, you know, we probably started slow, so yep. um, there's been an emphasis on that this week, but, uh, you know, starting well, staying in the grind and just controlling the footy, and uh, when we get our chances, take them. In regards to the start, have we cranked up a wee bit of the intensity this week? Yeah, we have. You know, training's been really positive uh, Tuesday and um, and our Thursday. Uh, but it's not just the start to Troy. You know, we've got to start well, but we've got to stay in it for the full 80. You know, from the first minute to the 80th minute, you know, it's going to be a grind. So, mm. Coming up against Mount Albert, structured team. You guys are old foes. This isn't the first time you've gone to battle, right? Yeah. And as I've said, this is 80 minutes, and this decides who goes to the final. Mm. What's the approach in taking Mount Albert on today? Well, you know, they're a pretty big physical middle, uh, so we've got to control the ruck, their ruck speed. Um, but I think if we can front up um, and on D, you know, sort of, you know, last week we were a little bit poor on defence, uh, so there's got to be, um, you know, some energy um, there to, you know, willing to get in and get the shoulders in and just, you know, just tackle hard, mate, you know, we've just got to front up today, yeah. In regards to the personnel, have we got new boys in, old boys out, uh, injuries? How are we looking, mate? Have you got your group um, of 17? Yeah, 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 we have. So Arden's back uh, from uh, his duties with Samoa. Uh, so he'll slot back into the side. Uh, Wax is back in this week. Uh, so he'll go back into the halves. And uh, Patrick Sipley's back from the Warriors this week. So he'll start for us. Awesome. All right, mate, look, I know this is a, um, a big day and you've got a wee bit on. Thanks very much for your time. On behalf of the Auckland Rugby League, congratulations to the Pirates to get to here. More importantly, best of luck for the next 80 minutes. Cheers, Troy. Thanks, mate. OK, with the head coach of the Mount Albert Lions and uh, main game today, mate, there's no other 80 minutes after today's match. Momentum off last week's game, how good was that? Were you happy with the boys' performance? Oh, yeah, the boys were really good last week, very clinical and executed well. So, you know, pretty much the same format for this week, you know, in terms of you know, quality side with some real, real experience. So we're looking to pretty much replicate that performance again. I mean, you must have been very happy with the execution. I mean, um, they were flawless in the first half, 34 yeah. points up against Glenora, who was coming off a wee bit of momentum. Yeah. Bringing that into this week, mate, what's been the chat with you and your group? Oh, you know, we, we were pleased with it, with how it all panned out in that first half. I think we started well. I think we just got to, uh, we've tightened up a few areas in defence so that we can do a bit better in, in terms of where Glen are exposed us a little bit. And um, so, yeah, pretty much uh, pleased again, but again, uh, hopefully we've got another good performance in us. In regards to today's match, you know, up against the old foes, Point Chevalier, yeah. and um, um, and as we said, you know, this is a do or die match. Yeah. For you and your team, any difference in the approach today? Um, what's the strategy in taking on the Pirates? Oh, well, there's no, um, you know, no, no second loss. We're aware of the, the challenges in front of us. Um, you know, they've been a good good team for the last three or four years, so they're not going to lie down and, you know, get the championship up easily. So, you know, we're looking for a real good battle to, against them, and I know that they've got some quality players that will stand up in this, uh, this game, but um, hopefully we can match that and come over the top. Awesome, mate. And look, in regards to this week, has the intensity picked up with the Mount Albert boys coming into this match? Oh, yeah. I think it's, um, you know, just maintained or possibly uh, improved in terms of it. But um, boys, are, boys are really excited about it. You know, we've got a young team and uh, they're looking forward to the challenge. Awesome. Well, look, on behalf of the Auckland Rugby League, congratulations on getting to here. Yeah. But more importantly, best of luck for the next 80 minutes. Cool. Thanks, Sean. Thank you. Major semi-final of the Fox Memorial Championship. 2-0 early, but the first try came to Eddie Purcell after six minutes. 6-0, four minutes later, and it's big Pat Sipley. Just back into the squad, and Sipley, well, look at him. He's been in the gym for ages, and he's strong, tough. Daniels was in seven minutes later. Yeah, beautiful work down the right edge from uh, Point Chevalier. And Taylor Daniels going over and scoring that, that try for the second try for Point Chev. Willie Peace was outstanding in the first half. Got a lovely ball. He was in to score too. That was just on the half hour. And yep. Tolu added another four points. Watch this run from Tom Awake. He gets the quick play of the ball. And a bullet pass from the 
super confident young rake and halfback, I should say, was Zay Wallace punching it wide for Tolu to score. Half time split 16 12 to the Lions. Yep, but the uh, Boy Chevalier Pirates took the little opportunity down the blind side and Malo Malo uh, Solomon scored the first of his two tries. Satai was next. Have a look at this run. The big guy bounces through one, pushes off another, comes at the fullback, says out of my way, and he's in to score. That certainly pumped up the Pirates. They were fancying their chances up by 22 18. 77 minutes into the game. Look at this. The bounce. Sweet. The hands, wonderful, the try, wraps it up. They go into the final, the Pirates. 26-18 winners. Okay, with the captain of the mighty Mount Albert Lions, and uh, we've just come off the end of the uh, match against Point Chevalier, and this was a must-win must game. 80 minutes just gone, mate. Massive battle. First thoughts for you? Yeah, just, um, that was just a tough game out there. Like, point really give it to us, and then, um, yeah, we just slept off in the second half and yeah, paid for us and uh, came off the last one. No, I'm still proud of it uh, from the boys and happy with the um, new coach, uh, Willie, and all the stuff. And, yeah, it's been a good season, so. Mate, I mean, uh, Mount Albert certainly came into form coming into the finals. Um, at this match, you guys are right in it. Half time, what was the message from Willie Swan? Uh, just uh, just completing our sets and um, just uh, try to be a bit more aggressive on our defence with, with their big forwards running around. So, yeah. Sweet. Well, listen, on behalf of the Auckland Rugby League, congratulations to the Mount Albert Lions in regards to how far you've gone this year. Commiserations on today. And hopefully you have a few uh, green teas tonight and a couple yeah, of shandies. <laughs> With the captain of Point Chilea Pirates just coming off the map. Off the uh, a do or die game, 80 minutes. Mount Albert, first thoughts, mate? Oh, you know, very strong team up the middle. Um, fast to play the balls. Um, and we knew, you know, the game was going to be one up the middle. We let in a few uh, easy tries in the first half just because our middles went barring up. Um, so we knew in the second half we'd head to, uh, you know, up the ante. A uh, couple of extra big bodies inside the Pirates team, and I understand there's a wee bit of intensity coming into training this week. That certainly boded well. Oh, yeah, you know, it's always good to um, get Patrick back from Cup. Um, you know, he definitely uh, lifts the morale of our forwards um, and the rest of the team. So, yeah, just, just uh, thankful to go uh, play in this uh, good to see a wee bit of chat there coming from Wax as well. Um, you know, screaming at the boys, keeping their heads up, getting the correct body language at half time. What was the message from the coach? Yeah, just just winning um, the tackle up the middle. Um, you know, I think that was one thing we really missed against Kura um, was having Wax um, and just his, his, his guidance and, um, and his talk on the field. Um, you know, it, it goes a long way, especially in this finals footy. All right, mate. We're going to let you go on behalf of the Auckland Rugby League. Congratulations, and uh, we see you next week with another 80 minutes. Cheers, mate. Thanks.